Hello guys, welcome back to our channel and today I would like to share with you some tips about the skincare I use and the products I recommend for daily and firstly I would like to start from um, cleansing procedure and for the cleansing step uh, I mainly use two products one is the cleansing form from Namek I have been using this product for years because I have a general sensitive skin and sometimes I have some redness and red vessels around my nose and this product can help to soothe the symptom and sometimes I have some breaks out like small acne around uh, this area on my face and uh, after washing with this product and the acne themselves seems dries away uh, quickly after yeah, a while and uh, for the Makeup removing step, I use Chanel cleansing oil. Now, the texture of this product is oily, but it becomes milky after being mixed with water. And the milky texture can gently help to remove the eye makeup and also the foundation and lip gloss completely. And both products are very gentle and they are all suitable for the sensitive skin type. And for the skincare procedure, um, actually it depends on what function I want to achieve that day. Sometimes I have sensitive skin problems and then I need to use the classic moisturizing cream from Namek. And we all know that for this cream, you need to warm them up before you apply it on your face in order to let it be absorbed by your skin. But I found it's very difficult to warm them up by your own hands and also it takes just too much time. So I accidentally found a nice companion product, the Sensei Notion 2, and uh, worked together with the moisturizing cream. I use the Notion 2 because my skin is very dry and it is from the Cellular Performance series. It has been anti-aging function. Actually it's supposed to be uh, used with their own uh, products from this brand but anyway I just found them work well with each other and yeah I recommend this product as a companion to this cream so it helps to save your time and let your skin absorb the cream immediately and usually I use the super aqua serum from Grunheim um, this cream, uh, well it's, it's not cream it's a serum but uh, the texture of the serum is quite uh, creamy so it's between the cream and fluid and I use this one in the winter because my skin is very uh, sensitive and dry in the winter and most of the products cannot really help to hydrate enough even the La Mer moisturizing cream is not moisturizing enough for me it's only more helps to soothe and calm your sensitive situation but this cream is by far the most hydrating cream I have ever used. So I strongly recommend if you have the same skin problem, um, you can choose this one. You can try it first and then decide if it suits your skin type and if it causes the allergic situation. And the texture of this one, as I said, is between the Floyd and the cream. So you can use it just all in one. It's not too light and it's uh, thick enough to just use only one product before your makeup and now for the eyes problem um, currently I have used the cellular eye cream platinum real uh, I have always used the eye cream from Lapali because this brand is very specialized in eye problems in solving eye problems and before this product I have been using Lapalis uh, caviar eye cream for years and it works amazingly but I just have to uh, change it to other products as an alternative in order to achieve the best effect um, for all the eye cream from Lapalis I mean from high end the most uh, the most obvious effect is that you can see your fine eyes or dark circles or eye bags are relieved visibly after applying on the eye cream even for several times and your eyes wouldn't get uh, addicted to it if you stop using it it's still okay but of course as a recommendation you better rotate different types of eye cream after half a year something like that and last but not least 
uh, I always use some protection uh, as the last step for my skincare before applying on the makeup. Uh, I always use some protection, whatever, what kind of weather outside. And I use this one because it has SPF 50 and it's, I assume it's high enough to protect your skin from morning to night for all day long. And if you go to beach on vacation, I just never get sunburned by using this product. And the texture of this product is not that oily compared to most other products in the market. And this one, uh, it doesn't generate the clays after you applying on the uh, foundation or foundation powder. So I guess the girls who do the makeup would love to try this product. Okay, this is all the information I would like to share in this video today. And the next time I will do a separate uh, section video about the comparison between the cushion foundation by Namach and the cushion foundation by Lovely. And this is our two uh, new uh, foundation products I have tried. I have been using it for like half a year, so I will have enough uh, experience to share the tips or other knowledge. Okay, thank you for your time watching my video. And uh, if you have any ideas, opinions, just leave your comments under the video. I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.